I'm Donnie Simpson, and you're watching In the Community TV. In 2008, uh, Obama stopped to record and send a congratulatory message to Mr. Simpson, citing the media giant. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, as always, back in the community of Washington, D.C., with our area producer, Gail Delicious Johnson. We're at the Howard University with the Miss Tina Knowles Fashion Show. We have Donnie Simpson, who's about to be honored here. Well, we're going to try to do an interview real quick with Donnie Simpson. How you doing, brother? My brother, this is a pleasure Look seeing you again, home. man. Oh, Tell us what's going on with you, man. has served as an honorary chairman of the National Black Family Reunion and has assisted in the fundraising efforts for AIDS research and the United Negro College Fund. I know you're still out there doing everything. First, a generation. I mean, you wake up to everybody hearing what's going on. Tell us more what's going on, how people can get in contact with you, man. Shaheed from ITC TV. We got Gail Johnson. Hi, Hi, Papa. Are you doing right? All right. All right. Oh, good to meet you. Oh, it's Pleasure. Show when you were on. Oh, thank you. Sorry you love. Thank, yeah, yeah. Oh, it was time. Good to see you. Yeah. Good oh, good thank you. You. you too. Very good to see you. You too. It's a pleasure. So tell us. So, so, so tell us. So tell us what's bringing you to DC today. This is well. I live here in DC. So, uh, <laughs> but but this event, they are honoring me. all of the characteristics and qualities that we want our students to emulate. We want them to know that you can achieve high heights, but you can also give back and help those that are the least among us. So we thank you again. We're delighted to have you part of our alumni club with all the rights and privileges there too. Yeah, we just want to say congratulations to everything you're doing, man. Congratulations to the work you work doing for the community. You know what I'm saying? Thank you. What more can the community do, you know, to get the, the system? going on there's a lot of things that's going on today in this country we talk about the children we talk mentoring programs we talk about everybody out there who need help so what, what, what can we the message you can give to the, the youth out there uh, to believe in themselves you know that's uh i think that's what they need most you know so many of them don't uh you know and, and a lot of times it's our fault because the examples haven't been presented to them you know so you know, I just, you know, I, and I know it sounds so cliche, but uh, all things are possible, you know, if you believe in you, you know, it's what you really want to do. That's what we talk about, rough times, people make mistakes, mm -hmm. you know, what do you like to tell them when they make a mistake? Encouragement. Some people they make a mistake and they feel like that's it. Yeah, well, I mean, you, you, you came a long way, you made some mistakes. So what, you know. Yeah, I make them every day. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, mistakes aren't. It's just learning experiences, you know. I mean, you know, I've always felt like uh, there's only experience. It's not bad experience. I, you know, I just feel like even things that you may have made you uncomfortable when you were in them, if you learn from them, then it's experience. So it's still good, you know, whatever it is. That's that's the way I look at it. And uh, so you make mistakes, but, you know, it's not about how you fall. It's about how you get up, you know, and what you do after the fall. So... Yeah, I know you got so much to do. Once again, we'd like to honor you for what you're doing. We appreciate oh, thank you, everything you're doing. Stay thank in the community. You, and as always, keep it here. Yeah, my man. Look at this, a two-shot with y'all guys. Of course. Hi, Mom. <laughs>